All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're here with another part of this Indiana Jones and the Great Circle walkthrough. So we finished off the last part in an embarrassing fashion. Um, I thought I clicked on the right adventure location, but apparently we went to a Vatican mystery again. We did uh, we did House of God also last part, but the main one I ended off on was Secret of Secrets. I thought it was that um, to head to the enter the Tower of Nicholas V. I thought that's where I was going, but no, I went to the wrong location. So we're going to actually do this in this part. Um, we probably wouldn't have had time to finish anything in the, everything in the last part anyways, but now we can actually get into it. <laughs> it was very embarrassing on my part. I had to look up. I, I had to look up the code. I got the numbers right, finally, but I put them in the wrong order. Well, two of them in the wrong order. I put 1-7, it's 7-1, and eh, that was close. But now we'll actually enter the Tower of Nicholas V. This is back where we were with... Yeah, okay. The Lord be with you, Father. That's back where we were with the... I think this is the post office, right? Yep, okay. Now I know where we're going. For any of you captains, because I know you guys can get rid of my... Is this restricted? Who fool in this guy? I'm just gonna walk. Should walk past you. Any more captains? What secret library below? Tower of Nicholas V. Is this a restricted area? I don't see a restricted icon, so I think I can trespass just fine. What's down here? Yeah, sewers. I don't need to go there. Keep up the good work, sir. Why would some random, random priest be in here? I mean, I'm not gonna hate on it, cause probably weirder things happen here, but it is a little weird. Oh, I thought those were people. Oh, those are statues. Okay. Oh, bottle of wine. The blood of Christ, as he was mentioned in the last part. Oh, that is blood red. Yes. Okay. Is that it? We gotta twist it. How far are we going here? Just one full rotation? There it goes. I totally meant to do that. Explore the underworld. That's not a creepy name to give something. I don't really like this already. Time to step into the underworld. Oh, we got a club. I'll stick to the light for now. Oh, that's a torch. Okay, how long does the torch last? I'll stick with the torch, preferably. Does this have a lifespan, or is it just, uh... Infinite torch, like most other games? Oh god, don't be a horror game, please. Underworld map. That's all it is for a map, really. Brazier. I'm not sitting in the dark. I don't I don't like the dark. Oh, that's creepy. I'm getting uh London catacomb vibes. Or is it Paris? I forgot where it is. Light this torch. Give me some light along the way. God, this gives me like real horror movie vibes or I'm going to get a jump scare here in a second. At least it gives me torches along the way. 
Oh, I just lit it up. Oh, that scared the crap. I thought I set off a pressure plate. More bottles of wine. Let's explore real quick. He took a cuff and gave thanks. He gave to them saying, Let's get this out of the way. <clears throat> Oh, so there's more, um... Where'd my torch go? I like a... I like my torch back. There it is. Okay. So there's stuff I can take photos of. Well, let's give 25 a piece. That's pretty good. Five sacred wounds. This angle's no good. They saw Jesus approaching the boat walking on the sea, and they were terrified. So I probably can't get in there until I pour the bottle of wine. Can I get my torch out of the way first? So we got two to pour into at the moment. Well, this is my blood of the covenant, poured out for many unto remission of sins. Solve the sacred wounds puzzle. I'm not ready for that, honestly. How much wine do I have? I'm lost already. Let's see what this does. Yeah, that's my own fault. Oh, so I can... Can't get another torch, though, at least. Light up the brazier in this room. Oh, it's another one. Longinus. Soldier who pierced the side of Jesus with a holy lance. I don't know what we're supposed to be figuring out. I'm so lost. Three. Oh, three. Some kind of chemical reaction to the wine. Oh, that's what it says, Fragile Walls. Huh. I'm sure someone will fix that. Wait, do they all have... Oh, the codes in them. Three... What was this one again? I had to go back in there. I don't know what order it goes in, but that's three... Let's go from left to right first. Did I not get a photo of this last time? You gave to the body of Christ. Said, Take, eat. This is my body. Oh, I thought I put one in here. Three, two. We're just going to go off left to right. Let's 
Let's go off that for now. If that doesn't work, we'll find out what else it could be. This one was... Is this unlimited wine? <laughs> I've poured so much wine out. Three. Three. Some interesting puzzles. I'm 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 just a little on the dumb side half the, half the time of my own problem. She at the feet of Jesus and wiped his feet with her hair. Four. Okay. I'll light all these up, why not? And you can pull the chain down. Okay, I hope this is the right order. If not, I don't I don't really know what to do here. It was three two two. Oh, okay. It's going to go by body part, isn't it? Because the spear that pierced his body, right? Golden Chalice is in his right hand, so that was a two. I think I'm getting it now. So we know that one. What was... Right foot. Which one's that? This is left foot is three. So I know we got left hand, right foot. What was this one? Oh, that's his left foot, which is four. And then we need the spear and the right hand. Which was... Spear was... Three. And this was a two, wasn't it? Two. Okay. Three... Three body, two hand. I think this is what it is. Three body. And then... Two for the hand. Yes, okay. Did it right. Sacred Ruins puzzle completed. Oh Lord, show us the way. Find the giant warrior's tomb. This is so creepy, man. Oh my god. This opens up way too far. For some ordinary place. I don't want to be rude, but they have if they have loot, I want loot. What is that red? Dude, that is creepy as heck. Nobody noticed a big open air tunnel? Did I not get that thing? I need to light all these braziers. I'm not really afraid of mice as I am spiders. This 
place must be thousands of years old. Light it up. Ancient Roman burial ground. Not good vibes, I'll tell you that. Oh lord, that goes down even further. Okay, I don't see anything here. Let's light up another brazier. Where does it want us to go? Oh, burial chamber key. What's this? I'll take that. I don't think you'll be needing this anymore. Where am I going? I zoom out this way. from a journal medieval <laughs> I don't think this is where I need to be going let's go back up we can come back for this some other time if, if it's really important if it's really important we'll probably need to go down there anyways, but for now... Oh, okay. No, that just leads to the bottom side of where we just were. Um, I would like a torch, though, if anything. Well, this should burn down easily. Yeah, but I, I don't... I don't have anything to... Hey, I'm only not as scared of... Yeah, but... How do you get a lantern? If you use the whip at all, it, it ruins, so... I don't even think it's important. That might just be some other secret area that I can't get to for the time being. Let's head into the burial chamber here. Burial chamber key. Oh! Hey, now I can light it up. Where's the, where's the lantern at? Where's the torch at? Is there any torches on the wall anywhere? Four. Is there going to be a fight here? Why does it feel like there's about to be a gunfight? And can I please get a torch? Dude, what if there's this? not a gunfight here, I'd be surprised. What is this place? Nope, I need a photo. Tomb of the Warrior Giant. Tomb of Augur, the giant. 80, wow, the okay. The service of God at Escalon. The Warrior Giant. Augur the Giant? I found it. You're not pushing that. I love you, Indy, but you're not. Too heavy. Ain't no way you're heavy pushing that. Another way to open it. What's above him? Those look like pressure plates. What is this? Don't put your arm in there, please. Oh, you would I not put work. your arm in there. I would. Check the other side. Did it open one? Oh, now you press the pressure plate. We gotta rotate it back. Crusader shields. Oh, drop. Is that a... We'll drop it for now. We're going to pick that up afterwards. Oh, God, no. I told... Oh, you're lucky I didn't just throw this remote. I'm not... I don't like spiders. I don't... I don't F with spiders. 
Oh my god, I flinched off that. What'd you do? What the heck is going on? Come on. Oh, I broke it anyways. Nice. Oh, don't freaking desecrate his corpse here. What the heck? Now we can get inside of his uh, tomb. I really hate to ruin the guy's tomb there, but a big fella, aren't you? he's called a giant for a reason. I'm sure, you won mine. Was it inside his body? That was inside his ribcage. All right, what what do we got now? of confession entrance to the sacred monastery of the Nephilim order there it is so it's some Vatican secret order I think it might be time to run That's not good. That's not good. Well, big guy did some good deed way in the past. We just destroy his tomb over it. Jeez. I do love the Lion Tamer Whip. The main reason I pre-ordered the DLC, or the pre-ordered the game, is so I could get, um, make sure I get the DLC for whenever it comes out. I don't know if I'll film it, but I'll definitely play it. Great. I'll just have to find another way out. I would like a torch. Oh, that's not creepy. I thought it was a Draugr for a second. Necropolis lower map. I can't even get by you, can I? No, I can't. Okay. All right. I really don't like spiders, so please no spiders. I don't mind mice. They're not my favorite, but I don't mind them. We're going to have to lower down, aren't we? And I can't see. Where are we going? <sighs> this is very stagnant water. I'm going to be honest. I would not want to swim in this. We can swim a little faster. It's not super useful. How the heck do we get out of here? What the heck is that? Oh, it's a crack. Where's Light's showing through. That looks like an exit. Oh, lots of corpses. Let's not desecrate any more tombs while we're here, please, Indiana. I've already destroyed one tomb today. I don't want to destroy any more. Maybe through here.
Oh, great. More bandages. Got any other two handed weapons? Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I love being all PG, but we definitely killed those dudes. Those are uh, definitely dead. But I will take another one if you have one. Getting a little stutter, like I said. I don't know if that's on my end. I don't know if it'll come through on the video anyways, but... What the heck is over here? Oh, it's another thing to burn down. I'm not going to bother with this. Let's get back to uh, Antonio. It's a secret, but I'm not going to mess with it. Let's get out of here. What are we actually doing? Find a way out. That's it. Is there going to be any more, any more fascists? I just want to see if you could crawl through it or something. Oh, it's actually the way we're going. Okay. Where's the actual exit? So I gotta get up on the second second level. I'm gonna try off this right side here first. If I wait for him to do one more loop back, 
It should time up because this guy is right here, I think, right now. Wait for them to head back that way one more time. Worst case scenario, I just get in the hand to hand combat. Actually, while we're here. Don't know how that works. What weapon do you have? Baton? I'll take a baton. around the back here. How do you get out of here? Looks like that's the way out right there. It's so dark. Walk back that way. There's a couple guys. I'm gonna take this sledgehammer. How'd you get at? How'd you? How are you still awake? I don't know how you're still awake, old buddy, old pal. Oh, shut up! I'm already out. You could I could have just snuck across, but I like the combat, honestly. Okay, we're finally out of this place. Oh. <laughs> 
Yeah, I like the combat. It is fun. I can't imagine a gunfight in this game being any fun. How the heck we get out of here? I'm at the exit, but how do I exit? There's some wall I have to break down? That's a relic, too. How do I get in there? They didn't- okay, they didn't just spot me. I was getting really worried there. Maybe it has to- to-, to, to uh, Oh, okay, it is. To do with the busts. Nice. So, is there another? Is there another antique bust? It's probably pretty far back. I don't know if I want to mess with it. It is very dark in this game. But I figure there's a... Oh wait, can I just take it off this one? And open up this side? Get the relic and pop back out, put it back in place? Yes! Nice. A long time ago. That makes more sense. I thought I had to go find another. I didn't think you'd be able to take it back off. That makes more sense. Let's pick up our weapon. I don't know how far to the actual exit here. You know what? We're going to go... First thing we're going to do... Right outside this door. I think there's a box of... Nope, that's not... Dang it, I thought there was a bundle here that I could light up another torch. Good as it is. Oh, yeah, it is. Thought I saw one. I want to light up these braziers. It's so dark in this game, man. I don't want to turn off the brightness either because it's going to ruin the vibe, but. Give me some light here. This is the way out. Good. Gonna climb up top here, whip even further up. There we go. Do I still have my torch? No, use the whip, you drop it. Any more antique bus? Because that looks like a pressure plate one again.
Here we go. Can't sprint, but I can't get in here now. Nice, another relic. This to the collection. I am going to take one of these weapons with me. Unless I see a bundle of, uh, for a torch. I prefer a torch. I don't see a container of bundles. Dang it. Give me some torches, man. Is there any on the wall? Am I just being dumb again? Yep, there is one on the wall. Okay. Better. I just want to be able to see over anything, man. It is so dark. It's cool, but it's dark. <laughs> Going down. I just got my torch back. Don't make me lose it again. Yeah, nobody heard that. We're gonna drop the torch for now. Go, go quiet. Great. Back where I started. Very much like a weapon. I think I'm at the very least going to take care of that guy in the middle. But I really want a weapon before that. Is there a weapon down here, man? <laughs> hey, actually, I'll, I will... down look at that perfect because if I could take out one guy I can get another weapon and repeat that was worth it
Once they head out of the main area there, over to the right, I'll knock this guy out and climb up. Just gotta wait for that to happen. I'm trying to play actually stealthy. Come on, go back, so I can knock this guy out. Sweet dreams, fella. You don't see me, it's all good. How do they already got scaffolding set up in here? I think I need to whip up when I'm out here. Yeah, I think I need to get up on the roof of the tractor. Don't get stuck. <laughs> Not exactly what I wanted. damage myself on what I was damaging myself on there, but... Okay, let's get the freak out of here. Nobody's gonna find it suspicious if I just stumble up to the top. <laughs> up to the top. This was its, an insane on, on its own little mission. It was fun, though. God, they did a good job with these. And how'd they get scaffolding? I was not, like, knocked unconscious or anything. How'd they get scaffolding up so quick? insane how quick they can do that apparently <laughs> it's all gonna crumble down isn't it thanks pal I don't say all right that's um That is not nice. He's a fascist, whatever. Oh, pure luck. And she's picking a lock. Is she a treasure hunter too? Archaeologist, what? What are you up to? Let's go find out. Excavation sites. It says restricted area, but I don't even see anybody here, so. Just gonna be a little bold and walk up right to the door. Where'd you go?
Oh, Apostolic Palace. Note. News article. Shanghai article. Japanese bomb... Bombs kill hundreds in Shanghai. Yeah, this is... Oh, yeah. This is during that time. We are living in troubled times. Yep. You forget the time period we're in. Is this locked? Where'd the nun go? Oh, it's through the main door. Okay. Get in here. That's my size. Uh, anyone see a nun? <laughs> oh, camera opportunity. That's not a good angle. Oh Maria, concepita senza peccato, prega per noi che ricorriamo a te. Nice. I should be able to afford another book now, and can I? What do I have left? Splinter Smash is what I have available. I can't afford it. Nice. Oh, here's the nun. Enjoying the view. <laughs> Excuse me, Father... Gallagher, is spying on people part of your daily nun routine, sister? Well, I was actually just... bird watching. Uh, the Nazis are involved, aren't they? I mean, I can't read lips, so... An old friend of yours? <laughs> That's Emmerich Voss, German archaeologist, leader of the Fears of Cold Research Program. And you know that how? The Lord revealeth his secret unto his servants. <laughs> nice. Is that so? Dr. Indiana Jones, Professor Archaeology Department, hey. Marshall College, Bedford, Connecticut. Yeah? And you ain't no nun, sweetheart. You know nothing about me. Well, I might not be a priest, but I'm pretty certain stealing is a straight no-hitter with the Ten Commandments. Not entirely certain what the rules are for a reporter. Oh, to you. You were taking notes in shorthand. I'm an investigative journalist, and right now I'm looking into the disappearance of someone very dear to me. She was abducted more than six months ago. And I believe your friend Emmerich Voss is responsible. That's Dr. Laura Lombardi. Do you know her? She's one of the world's leading experts in ancient languages. Yes, and most importantly, she's my sister. My name is Ginetta Lombardi. What's your business here? I'm looking for a cat. A cat? A mummy. A mummy or a cat? It's a cat mummy. <laughs> why? Because a giant from the Vatican stole it from me and I need to figure out why. You probably that sounds so strange. strange. Yeah, <laughs> sounds way off. The answer you give me stirs up more questions. Like why do you have a cat I mummy? Don't ask. What about this? We hear anything that could be interest to the other. We trade information. Deal? Yeah, all right. Miss Lombardi, deal. Good. You can call me Gina. See you around, Strambo. Should definitely bring this back to the library. Okay, we're returning back to uh, Antonio. Ooh, perfect zip line. How far away are we? Hmm. Hmm. All 
right. I gotta follow the map because I have no clue where I'm going. It's so easy to get lost. Oh, yep. It's not a restricted area, is it? Just a lonely priest. No need to worry about me. Ooh, repair kit. And a card. Savage Discovery. Alright. <clears throat> now I kind of know where we're going. Now I gotta worry about the captain down here, don't I? Oh, no, I go right here. There we go. Belvedere Courtyard. Belvedere, Belvedere. Oh, out of stamina. I kind of want to break in there real quick. Oh, the nun's right there. Wait, is that Catherine? Looks like Catherine. If I just sneak in here, would you get mad? Oh, she don't care. Oh, okay, it's another nun. Oh, scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Greetings, Father. That looks like Catherine. Alright, let's get back up to Antonio here. Are you still adjusting the painting? Dude. The light fixture guy is working on a different one. Presto, le autorità competenti li passeranno al vaglio. Oh, qui si coltiva la conoscenza. I fascisti non hanno alcuna autorità. Il Papa non sosterebbe mai azioni del genere. Beh, il Papa non è qui. No. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that guy. What's going on, Antonio? Let me talk to you. Once again, if you can hear my PC in the background, I very much apologize. Ventura's letter. All right, Antonio. You all is. I just spoke with Sister Catherine. She mentioned a diary written by Father Crescenzo. You know about it? I'm afraid you are too late, Indy. I had just found it when Father Ventura and his black shirts came and took half of my collection. The diary included. It must be important. What's in this diary? I don't know. Maybe more of Crescenzo's writings on giants and fallen angels. I had forgotten all about it until Sister Catherine brought it up. Think. Where would they take it? I believe they keep confiscated material in a room inside the Apostolic Palace. And there is an entrance that leads there from the sewers. Should I ask how you know this? You may ask, but do not expect an answer. Good luck, Henri. Dude, Antonio is just the best. He's just the best. How can you hate on this guy? Is this still part of... Uh... This is part of the you mad priest. The yeah, we're yeah, not going to worry about the mad priest at the moment. Let me see. I don't know if, if, if I need to do this.
very curious what you discovered down there. Right, let's re let's finish off this mission. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do it. Uh, we might we might do it. For now, let's finish up this with the parchment and a the stolen cats. From the first crusade, concerning a secret order right here in the Vatican. This, this is astounding. Grazie, Indy. So where are you going next? Fountain of Confession. Be careful, my friend. You might be going down a rabbit hole. No telling where it might lead. Investigate the fountain. There we go here. Investigate the fountain. Use the camera for hints. According to the parchment, the Fountain of Confession contains a hidden entrance to the sacred monastery of the Nephilim Order. Um, like I said... Uh, we'll probably do both of these. We might investigate the field work. I don't know if I'll do any mysteries on camera. Uh, we might do some? I don't know. We did find three of the relics already. I don't know if there was more I could have gotten. Um, but we'll, we will start with the stolen cat mummy. And if we have time after we finish this part of the mission, um, we will do the mad priest. I'm interested in both of them. So, hope you guys enjoyed this part. Make sure to like, subscribe, leave any feedback down below. I will see you guys next time. Take care.